Okay, hey everybody, I'm coming at you guys with a quick hair review video. And this wig that I am wearing, I'm totally in love with. And this wig is from PlatinumWigs.com. And this is a soft, yakky bang wig. Um, it is in 14 inches and it is in a color, excuse me, 16 inches. And it is in a color 1B. So, um, I purchased this wig because I saw like countless wig reviews on it and i only really saw one negative review on it and um as you guys know i'm stretching my perms right now i'm eight weeks post perm so i can still work with my hair but um i don't really plan on getting a perm until after my birthday which is december 17th and around that time i'm gonna be like around 12 weeks post perm and um my last stretch was 12 weeks and then my last stretch before that was 11 weeks and I know some people stretch you know 20 weeks and these long periods of time 12 weeks for me is long so anyway back to the wig um, this Jackie hair is beautiful this is so soft it's very natural looking um, my best lace wigs um, lace front wig it's a little, I got silky straight, so it's really silky and fly away. This hair looks more like African-American perms hair um, or hair that has been blown out from a Dominicans, uh, at, if you go to a Dominican salon. So um, I purchased this wig last Thursday and it came in the mail that following Friday. I hadn't got like any... Um, emails where I could track my shipping by like the went that by that Monday so I emailed um, platinum wigs and I said you know am I going to get any kind of email so I can track my package and they said they were all out of the wig now the style that I got was the unstyled wig because um, I love how the styled wigs look but I said you know if I get an unstyled wig they start at 119 Whereas the style wig started like 169, 189. I just went ahead and got the unstyled wig and 16 inches. So with tax and everything, it came to I think 151. Uh, the price isn't on here, but I think I paid 151 dollars. Um, and so well, they emailed me back and said they were all out of the wig, but they should get some in soon and so it's it was like i guess six days and once um i called them i did start receiving emails saying your package has been shipped from atlanta so i ordered it on a thursday and i got it that following friday so a little over a week i guess eight days to get it um what else about this here to me this is a short 16 inches it comes right down to the boob area show you guys the back um the bangs came this long and i actually cut them and um i was wearing them to the side but today i wore it out for the first time and i did like a center part and you get this much parting space which is really good you can wear the bang on either side, the left side or the right side. And um, so eventually, I do feel like I'm going to uh, cut the bang shorter. But I don't want to cut it too short and mess it up. So I just have been wearing it like this. But I really didn't want to. I just ran out to the beauty supply store and to the ATM. And I just didn't want the big swoop bang in my hair. And um, that's not right too. I really like it um, across the center. But this is it. If you comb it the other way. Like I said, you can comb it either way. Um, it's very versatile. But once I'm tired of wearing it. With the swoop bang, I am going to probably cut it up here and have um, that blunt look. But the shears or the razor that I use to um, cut the bang, 
Let me bobby pin this because it's not really staying. But the razor that I used to cut the bangs was this Tinkle razor. And I'm sure you guys, I'm not sure if I showed you guys in a previous video. But it's a really good razor. And this um, end is for thinner hair. And this end is for thicker hair. And so I just use the thinner end. And I just go really slow. It tells you. This is for thinner hair for to cut less hair. And this is for thicker hair and to cut more hair. So I just, you know, start where I want it to go. And then I comb it down on an angle. So. I mean, that is about it. The cap. I have a bobby pin on the side. I, I'm not going to tape it or glue it. I've never glued down a wig. This is... Well, yeah, I've, I've taken down wigs in the past, but just to show you guys, it curls beautifully, but I'm just going to bump it to the side. But for $151, and um, I sort of felt like I styled the wig to fit my face. I didn't cut any layers in it or anything like that. A lot of the wigs on the website has a lot of layers in it and everything like that. And I don't know, I just wasn't feeling that. And I'm really liking how I styled this one for me. So, I think it is it's beautiful hair. Um... It is a short 16 inches, like I said, but I like that the length isn't too long or too unrealistic. Um, it's a very realistic texture, um, very close to my natural hair texture, and the hair just looks so healthy and beautiful. I did put a little bit of heat protectant initially when I flat ironed it, when I got it out of the packaging, but other than that, no product. I do not believe putting no products in your weave in your wigs unless you're towards the end of your rope with it and you plan on throwing it away soon. That's the only time. So that is it guys. Definitely pick you up some wigs from bestlacewigs.com. They have beautiful wigs. Um I love their yaki bangs. Great parting room. Um the unstyle you can style it yourself, make it your own. So, bye guys, and thank you so much for watching.